That's you. why she dies so many times. But I don't need you anymore. Oh, what? <laughs> you must be joking. No, I do. But I can be yours. I'll be here for you forever. And I'll never yell at you or make the you feel bad. The audio and video get desynced That's what you for wanted. some reason, so don't worry about it. I'm different than Mary. How can you <coughs> throw me away? I understand now. It's time to end this nightmare. No! I won't let you! You deserve to die too, James! You know, I bet it would have been a more effective scare if it was synced up properly. Exactly, you should have seen his reaction. Rifle. Boom. Yes, she will try and tentacle kill you. And if you look on Silent Hill Wookie, she's supposed to have, uh... Vaginas on her body. I think it's in hospital gown and cap. Yeah, I don't know. It, it, every boss fight is supposed to be something sexual with James and Mary. And I don't get it, really. And they're little bat moth things. And then you just shoot. It's not that hard. It's just tedious. I mean, I did not heal as often in this one as I did with pyramid head twins douchebags <laughs> which I meant to fight with the plank but apparently that would have done no damage to them as said the walkthrough shotgun yep. or rifle or laser and here camera angles are shit Yes, they are. I couldn't tell how close she was, and she was right there. Is she flying, or is she going on the rails? Uh... Look up? I, I, I can't look up. I think she may be floating. <coughs> You're a good witch. I'm a bad witch. You know, if she was actually like that, all the blood would rush to her head and she'd pass out and James would just win. But <laughs> probably that is not the case. No. And those things are going out the window. I shot you in the face. I think it's almost done now. Please be. And then we get to do the end credits and cutscene. Well, we won't talk over the ending because that's just monologue. Oh, dear God. But during the credits, be prepared for an announcement. But, yeah. Mary? Enjoy the wicked <coughs> morning credits. <coughs> we killed her! Woo! Woo! James. And I take her out the most epic way I can Forgive think of me. to do. Da -na 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 -na. Epic night swing! To die, James. Right Boom. through her legs. I wanted the pain to end. Enjoy the end. That's why I did it, honey. I just couldn't watch you suffer. No. That's not true. You also said you didn't want to die. The truth is... I hated you. I wanted you out of the way. I wanted my life back. James, if that were true, then why do you look so sad? It's 
Mary? James. Please. Please do something for me. Go on with your life. In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. You promised you'd take me there again someday, but you never did. Well, I'm alone there now, in our special place, waiting for you. Waiting for you to come to see me. Uh. But you never do. And so I wait, wrapped in my cocoon of pain and loneliness. I know I've done a terrible thing to you. Something you'll never forgive me for. I wish I could change that. But I can't. I feel so pathetic and ugly laying here, waiting for you. Every day I stare up at the cracks in the ceiling, and all I can think about is how unfair it all is. The doctor came today. He told me I could go home for a short stay. It's not that I'm getting better. It's just that this may be my last chance. I think you know what I mean. Even so, I'm glad to be coming home. I've missed you terribly. But I'm afraid, James. I'm afraid you don't really want me to come home. Whenever you come see me, I can tell how hard it is on you. I don't know if you hate me or pity me, or maybe I just disgust you. I'm sorry about that. When I first learned that I was going to die, I just didn't want to accept it. I was so angry all the time, and I struck out at everyone I loved most, especially you, James. That's why I understand if you do hate me. I want you to know this, James. I'll always love you. Even though our life together had to end like this, I still wouldn't trade it for the world. We had some wonderful years together. <laughs> Well, this letter has gone on too long, so I'll say goodbye. I told the nurse to give this to you after I'm gone. That means that as you read this, I'm already dead. I can't tell you to remember me. But I can't bear for you to forget me. These last few years since I became ill, I am so sorry for what I did to you, did to us. 
You've given me so much, and I haven't been able to return a single thing. That's why I want you to live for yourself now. Do what's best for you, James. James. You made me happy.